everybody, Charles, Music Mess of 2012, Frankfurt, Germany. That's Mark, and this is High Watt. And uh, y'all are probably used to seeing towers and stacks of high watt at Pompeii and Leeds and all that. But there's a lot going on on the ground at High Watt this year, right, Mark? Yeah, we've got a lot of new products. This guy's a very good guitar player, by the way. Yeah, thanks. Good, good job. Yeah, we've got some new pedals. We've got new amplifiers. We've got new English-made products. We've got a lot of new products, actually. Yeah, good. got some real cool stuff. Where are I mean, we gonna start, man. We'll start with the T40. This is a 40 watt. It's a 40 watt tube amplifier it's made in uh, China it's got fain, two fain 12 inch speakers channel switching all valve and it sounds really cool and it's also got power scaling so you can change it from 40 watts down to 20 watts at the flick of a switch which is really cool for either live or in the studio it's a cool amp it's got a little baby brother as well huh absolutely it's got well we've got the whole range we've got a 10 watt amp these are available in both heads and combos the head we do a, um, a 10 watt a 20 watt and a 40 watt. The 10 watt can be switched down to 2 watts or 10 watts. The 20 watt can be uh, 20 watts or 10. And the, uh, the 40 watt can be 40 or 20. Uh, we also do the 1x12, the 212 and the 412 extension cabinet to go with these, which have all got faint speakers. They're really cool. Awesome. They look too. Really nice. Now, what about the pedals here? You got a, This is brand new. Yeah, these are brand new. These are really cool, really excited about these. Obviously, we've gone for the classics, the phaser, the tremolo, the overdrive, and the distortion. We've actually just brought out a new one that's not here, unfortunately, which is a high-gain distortion, because uh, we got asked for that a lot. But these are really cool vintage-style pedals. They're all tube. They've got a 12AX7 in them, and they sound great. They've got great controls, and I'm sure you get a good demonstration shortly on these. All right, gang, we're going to listen to Tube Series T40 right now with Arthur at the uh, controls. as well mark what's the first this tremolo anything special that you dig about this this has got very cool cool control in it that takes it from a sine wave to a square wave so you can get a really smooth kind of valvey type tremolo sound and you get a really aggressive kind of in your face garage band sound it's really cool You love the distortion, you're telling me? Well, the distortion is very cool. It's really kind of dirty and mean and aggressive, and it just says rock and roll, basically. Try that one. All right, Arch is going to play the phaser for us, the high watt phaser. Overdrive. Phaser is very cool. I mean, it just reminds me of something from, you know, like the 70s, something off a Pink Floyd album, something like that. It's very cool. Uh, the overdrive is just a real nice, gives a nice grit to the sound, just takes the amp a little bit further, and then you can just go on the full on distortion after that to take you all the way. All right, Mark, this is two pretty special amps right here. Uh, tell us about what's going on. These are Dave's, huh? These are for Dave Grohl, yeah, absolutely. This top one is um, an amplifier that we made for Dave last year. We made him five of these. It's based on an SAP amplifier from the late 60s, which was used most famously by Jimmy Page in Led Zepp. Uh, it's got a, um, a foot switch on it, which is very rare for a, a hand-built amp from that period. And what that does, it brings down the volume. So in essence, you've got a rhythm and a lead volume. You attenuate the signal for the rhythm and basically turn it back on 
for the lead sound. It's very cool amp, all hand built in England, point to point wired. But we also then, obviously, Dave loves the amps, he's bought a load from us, but he also emailed us about uh, six months ago and said, the amp's great, I love it, but I also would like a channel switching amp so I can get a lot more gain out of it. So we got our techs uh, to basically design, build, and create this amplifier at the bottom, which is brand new for us. This is all hand built. This is the dogs. This is absolutely the best amp we've ever made. And it's, uh, it's a, a custom 100 amp with also an extra gain channel on there, but it's all hand wired. There's no PCBs in this. This is pure uh, hand wired tone. And it's, this is actually the first one, the prototype that's gonna be sent to Dave Grohl after the show. It's the dog's tail, right? It's the Mutz notes. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> All right, let's hear a bit of this, Arthur. Go to town. Sick. Thanks, Arthur. Nice. Very nice. So, uh, yeah, this does a lot. It does a lot loud, I guess. Yeah, if you turn this thing up, I think you have to have new eardrums afterwards. It's very, very loud, but very cool, very British. You know, you guys make great guitars. We, get, we make great amps. It's a perfect combination. It's a virtual love fest here at High Watt. Thanks a lot, Mark. Nice to hang with you, dude. Yeah, pleasure. Cheers, guys. Oh, uh, you guys got a website? Yeah, www.highwatt.co dot uk dot co dot uk from the high watt world in frankfurt music message 2012 this is charles for premier guitar <laughs> 